love collective welcome back to the platform thank you for watching as always please remember to like comment share subscribe to the youtube channel you are greatly appreciated i am sending you all lots of love joy peace and happiness many many blessings to you and your families as always i return to source i return to sender all negative energies and intend immediately and permanently okay all evil plans of your enemies are dismantled against you, past, present, and future. Anything the enemy has took, taken from you, plans to take from you, it is returned to you because it is yours. As I have said, so shall it be. Judgment is final. Let's go ahead and get into this tarot reading. We have someone out here. Um, there's some type of plan a group of people had or have. Um, that is not coming into fruition is a disappointment for them. Okay. These people were trying to harm you, have you on a lie, do all kinds of mad madness to you. Um, how this group started was they started off with doing some mental magic on you, doing voodoo, he do, she do, could do all kinds of nonsense behind the scenes. This was a co collaboration amongst a group of friends. It started off small and then they got a lot of people involved. You could have a couple behind the scenes as well that's been coming after you. You have quite a lot of few people, not a, not a few, you have quite a lot of people that have been coming after you trying to destroy you and they all have their own reasons for why they are trying to destroy you but no matter what they do they're all under judgment and you are protected okay so you don't have anything to worry about i had a dream about a few masculine sitting and having a meeting on when would be the best time to uh, do some type of sneak attack on a feminine energy. Maybe they're planning something for the winter time. A masculine is supposed to come to your home, uh, make you some type of offer or ask you for something. Someone's going to come to come play on your your emotions, play on your mental and things like that, get you to feel sorry for them. Someone could be going through some type of auditing by the IRS or the uh, yeah, the IRS could be auditing someone and maybe they want to get you involved. You have nothing to do with this. Someone is about to be losing all of their finances, all of their luxury item. Someone is used to living a good life, but they are living in fear because they're about to lose everything or they already lost everything and they start have to start all over. Okay. Um, the reason this person is having to start all over is because they came for you. Someone blocked some type of opportunity you were supposed to receive. Someone assisted a group of people in destroying your image. You manifested something in life and they went and stepped in and destroyed it. This is why Source is taking everything from this person. So this is justice. Someone was absolutely paid to hinder you, cause you some type of loss, and this is balance being brought into this situation. There could be a Sagittarius involved in here. It is what it is. This person has been showing up a lot in my readings. I don't know if this is someone you are familiar with. It doesn't have to be a Sagittarius, but I just, I just know the temperance car has been showing up quite a lot. So you could have a, a Sagittarius that's involved in this situation, but do not seclude it. It could be anyone in your life. Okay. You got a Capricorn, all kinds of people are Virgo, Pisces, honey. I've been seeing everybody, everybody uh, popping up in these reads. Okay. Um, these people were trying or uh, planning to sneak attack you. They wanted to hit you when you least expe uh, uh, expected it. They were basically trying to restrict you, restrict your movement, restrict your opportunities, restrict your uh, offers and all kinds of stuff, who you're interacting with, where you can go, just everything about you. And they are disappointed because guess what? You are still receiving your opportunities. They don't understand how you're still having new beginnings in life because they thought they had all avenues closed out. Okay. They thought they had cause you stagnations in every aspect of your life, but they're realizing that you still have offers coming in. People still want to work with you. Now, why do people still want to work with you? Because they find you to be someone very creative, very artistic, very genuine, very healing. But also with the fact that God is basically showing a group of people that they are not in charge of you. They have no authority over you. You are free to be. You are your own person. I'm telling you, you are your own person and you have every right to stand your ground and protect yourself. And your ancestors are standing their ground and protecting you. And justice is in this situation. There will be legalities with the seven of wands followed by the justice card coming out. That is an absolute confirmation that 
there is a legalities coming out of this there will be a court case or there could be a court case going on right now and so there's some type of balance being brought into a situation someone may be taking some type of action to come towards you while they're coming why they're coming we're going to find out it's nothing good someone is coming in to play with your emotions someone may have some type of lustful energy for you so be mindful when this masculine comes towards you yeah absolutely this could be a king of swords what this person is coming in to do is try to apologize and ask for forgiveness but he don't give two hits what it is he's done to you okay someone is going through a betrayal just like he betrayed you this is why he's coming in to tell you some bs story about how he lost this or he's he's in some trouble he needs help that is not your business to help this person this is clarity for you okay before someone partook in a situation he was warned not to take not to partake in it but he didn't listen and that is why i'm telling you he was warned someone could have even gone to a practitioner and she or he told him do not participate in what these people are doing it is not going to end well you are taking the wrong turn and yeah he absolutely went to see guidance he went to see guidance from someone, okay? And they told him, and it doesn't have to be a practitioner. It could just be someone that told him, hey, do not participate with these people. You'll be stuck in something you cannot get out of. This is a toxic group. This is a toxic couple. Do not cooperate with them. Do not collaborate with them. It's not going to end well. He still accepted the bribery that they gave him, all the, the donations, whatever you want to call it, and now he's losing everything. This group or couple may even be planning an ending for him because he wasn't able to fulfill his end of the bargain. Maybe this had to do with unaliving you. I'm telling you, everybody is burdened. Everybody is worried. Everybody's having anxiety. Someone in here deals with a lot of anxiety and they're all watching you and they know you know what it is they've been planning for you. Okay, you may have a group of people right now that are laying low. It, there's basically what they're doing is saying, if we just act like we're not interfering anymore, they're going to believe that we've left them alone and then we can surprise them with an attack or something. Nah, stay vigilant. Your ancestors are telling you to stay vigilant. These people are still watching you. I'm telling you, stay vigilant. Go within, think, okay? Think about what it is they're, they're, they're trying to do. They're trying to throw you off course. They're trying to throw you off course. No, they haven't uh, let go. These people are too broken on the inside to just let something go. These are people that have been coming after you, some of you for years, some of you for weeks, months, right? And they may need to take a new path. Some of these people are going to need legal counseling, legal representatives, because they're going to be headed in places where their money won't be able to help them. Someone, won't, someone may want to communicate with you because they want to end this chapter or something is ending for them. I don't know if someone has developed some type of emotions for you, especially this king of swords. There's something where he has developed some type of emotions for you. Maybe he's feeling like you and him have some type of past life past life connection whatever or he's seeing you as someone very genuine i don't know if he's going through healing i don't know what this is but be careful thread with caution with this person because there's something where they're trying to do where they're trying to get you stuck with them they get a hold of your finances because you have a lot of abundance attached to you you are someone with limitless opportunities opportunities excuse me limitless possibilities basically you're limitless when it comes to your abundance, this is why this person wants to attach themselves to you. But as far as the genuine love, there is no love. Someone may be being sent to you by like an emperor energy that has ulterior motive. Absolutely. This king of swords is attached to some other figure behind the scenes and they're all toxic. They're all on the same page on what they want to do to you. Why he's being sent to you. He's been paid. To come towards you he's not coming of his free will okay these are all people being paid to recruit other people into a coven and they're all fighting amongst themselves because everything they've been planning for you is falling apart these are not a bunch of narcissists trying to defeat you but they've been defeated already they are absolutely paying someone to come in and do you something this page of pentacles keeps showing up yeah they are absolutely paying someone to come in i'm telling you to do you something either to rob you do something to you 
something very dangerous that you won't be able to recover from. They're trying to end you. There could be someone in here that wants to come in and apologize to you for betraying you. They're, they're realizing that you were very genuine towards them and they betrayed their trust. They betrayed their friendship. It's, it is what it is at the end of the day. Don't hold any grudges in your heart for people. Forgive them and let them move on with their life. But someone absolutely wants to talk to you. They want to, they want to communicate with you. Okay. But they want to give you clarity about a situation taking place behind the scenes. But it's like, we already have clarity. What other clarity are you trying to give us? All right. There goes the King of Swords wanting to come in and give you clarity, but it's a setup. It's a setup. There's nothing genuine about what this man is trying to do. Okay. He's being sent by someone. There's something here with a queen, queen of, uh, 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 um, what is it? A queen of wands. This woman keeps showing up in a lot. I don't know why I keep getting a download on someone. There's a breakup going on behind the scenes. She thought she would be chosen for something, but she was not chosen. I don't know if she thought she would be chosen for a love option, a marriage. Someone was going to propose to her some type of business opportunity. She's realizing that she's not chosen. She wasn't the option. And this is her living in fear because she's about to lose everything. Someone is definitely going to be leaving her. Yeah, there's going to be a breakup. So she may be the one paying people behind the scenes to come in and do you something, but it's not going to come into fruition. This woman is headed at, someone is headed straight to the penitentiary. She is headed straight to the penitentiary. Like every action someone is taking, like someone has done something behind the scenes that has led to her being cut. She was trying to take an empress energy out. Okay. She's upset because someone chose you. Someone chose you and not her. They left her out in the cold. He left her out in the cold. Okay. Because he sees the truth about her. He said, I'm with you. I'm not, I'm not flourishing in life. Yeah. Life is absolutely difficult for this man with her. Their relationship is a burden. They've been struggling for a long time in this union. Okay, and this is a woman, yeah, that goes both ways. Lots of toxic indulgence and things like that. This is like an open relationship or something like that. They break up, get back together, or she maybe has like a side thing going on. Men and women is what I'm hearing. There's something like that going on. This is like a Jizzy Bell energy, uh, topple with a gold digger energy. And they're all fighting behind the scenes. The both of them could be fighting a lot behind the scenes as well. And he's leaving her out in the cold. He's like, I don't want to be a part of this anymore. I'm moving on because he knows the truth about her. He's going within. He may have gone and got a reading about her, found out the truth, right? There could be a court case going on. Maybe she tried to even steal from him because she realized that he would be leaving. He wants to communicate with you, bring something to your attention. Or he's looking over a betrayal. There's something where he's going over a plan, like something has been brought to his attention or something has been brought to someone's attention and they're looking at it. Like what these people were planning to do is not coming into fruition. This woman, maybe she was planning with a lover behind the scenes to cause someone an ending, like to have you out of here. And she does not want this exposed, but it's going to be exposed. So whatever she was planning to do is been exposed. So someone has some type of information on her. She may want to pay them so that they can shut up. Nah, someone is going to do the right thing. Because this is the only way you're going to learn your lesson. And she's losing sleep at night. She's losing sleep at night. Okay, she does not want someone communicating with you about giving you an, op an offer, wanting to work with you. Or about some type of promotion. I don't know if this is someone, she I don't think they're married. Because they're not showing up here as a match. I think this is just someone this man was either dating or working with. Maybe he just thought she was very beautiful or something like that. Maybe he thought she was genuine until he met you. And then he said, like, oh, so that's what genuine women actually look like. That's what genuine women actually behave like. And he wants to work with you, but she's been causing hindrances, interfering. And she got other people co to collaborate with her. So this man may be leaving her out in the cold, leaving an institution out in the cold. He no longer wants to work with them and wants to communicate with you to bring something to your attention. But whatever message he sends you, you are being advised to stay vigilant. Like look everything over. Look it over. Don't ignore anything. Do not sign anything without reading it. 
Make sure you take it to a, to a lawyer. If you've read it 10 times and it still don't make no sense to you, take it to a lawyer because there's some type of ulterior motive here. I'm telling you with the fact that this is starting out with the 10 of swords in the reverse and the three of swords, there's an ulterior motive. There's nothing genuine, but I'm telling you, there's nothing genuine. Illusions. There's something in here. Even this king of swords. I don't get a good feeling from him. I don't get a good vibe. I do not get a good vibe. What I get is an opportunist. This is an opportunist. Okay. And he wants to work with you because he knows you're very abundant. He's not, this is not him. This is why he wants to work with you because this is you. This is him, an illusionist, an opportunist. And he's, he has been monitoring every aspect of your life. Someone is a, is very controlling. Someone is power hungry. Someone's very greedy. Do anything for money. Okay. Trying to have some type of attachment to your abundance. This is all financially motivated. He knows that you are very skilled and he can make a lot of money out of your skills. This is why he wants a commitment with you. There is absolutely something here. You may be receiving some type of financial assistance or pay out from a different character, different institution that's going to enable you to focus on your work, on your business, whatever this is for you. But just be cautious. Stand your ground. Do not back down. Someone is coming in your energy to try you. They are coming in your energy to try you. I swear I saw a group of men in a dream having a meeting on how to destroy a feminine energy. They were coming up with a plan. One of them is supposed to come to your house to visit you, come with his problems, right? This is all planned out. They're going to be communicating with you and it's all to keep you stuck. Keep you stuck in every way possible. Okay. So if, if someone pops up at your house, you're not expecting, leave them standing out there. Leave them standing out there. I'm telling you, leave them standing out there because they, they come with nothing but sorrows and disappointments. You partner up with this person, you're going to be losing a lot. He's going through a lot of loss. Yeah, I'm telling you. Exactly what I had said in the beginning. He's going through a lot of loss. A whole lot. So he thinks you're about to be the one to redeem his finances. Why did he lose his abundance? For coming for you. For coming for you. So now he wants to call and play victim. And he knows why he, he knows. He knows. He knows why he's going through a loss. He caused you a loss, so he's going through a loss. There's a high priestess in here going through a loss as well. She came for you. They've all been working together behind the scenes to cause you an ending, and this is clarity for you, in case you didn't know. You don't need clarity from any of these people. You accepting clarity from these people is like, you know, someone does something to you. You know, like people that, uh, uh, let's say like a, 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 a serial killer or something. They, they do something to one of your family members and then they come and say that they want to help you heal. That's what that is. You don't need clarity from any of these people. Any communication you need since there's going to be some type of legalities or court case going on currently, the court system will take care of it. Do not let any of these people around you. I'm telling you, don't let none of them around you. Don't let none of them around you. They're all going through something. They are all going through something right now. They're all hanging out dry, like roasted meat. And this is all for coming for you. Yeah, legalities. Okay? They're all going through something right now, and it's just the beginning. I don't know why there's a high priestess in here uh, participating in something this ridiculous. Um, but she's learning her lesson. She's going through an ending. Oh, yeah. All those rituals she's been doing behind the scenes to cause, some, cause someone else a lot of loss. She's going through it herself. And you're recovering your abundance. There's a woman here. Some I don't know if she's privileged or something. She's going through an ending herself so that you can receive your abundance. Someone stole something. Someone pretends to be in the upright, but she's a, she's a common thief. 
She's a common thief. Yeah, that's a guy honest true. The courts, if there's a court case going on or some type of authority, authority figure, they know something has been going on and they've, they're looking into it. Oh yeah, they're looking into everything. All the, the secrets are coming out. All the answers are unfolding. All the, 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 the in-betweens and people couldn't get their hands on. They said something's not adding up. I just don't know what it is. Whatever you don't know what it is, is coming out. Clarity is being brought into this situation. You will be receiving a new offer. And this is what they want to do is take it from you. It's like every time you're supposed to go through some type of growth sprout, they step in and they take it. They lie. There's some type of infiltration that's going on. There is a, a masculine. There's a masculine and a feminine energy infiltrating co uh, uh, companies. Infiltrating companies, excuse me. Okay. They have a problem with someone. This is just an example. They'll have a problem with someone. If you work for that company, they will infiltrate that company to cause problems for you. So let's say you are, oh, what is it? Do, 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 do. Whatever position you work. I'm trying to, I'm trying to think of this, like the analogy I can use. Okay. Uh, let's say you have like, of course, customers coming into your, into your, the company you work for, right? Let's say you are the one that greets the customers at the door. Okay. And you greet everybody every day. Hi, John. Hi, Mary. Welcome back. Uh, welcome to, uh, uh, whatever company you're working at. Okay. So you smile with people every day because you had a problem with these people. Well, they have a problem with you. You don't have a problem with them. Because they have a problem with you outside of your work, they will find a way to infiltrate this company and start causing you problems. They will start calling to make reports on you. Oh, you know, I came in at 8 a.m. this morning and Billy didn't tell me hi. He didn't greet me because they're trying to get you in trouble with your supervisor so your supervisor can fire you. Someone does this. There's a couple that does this. And they have issues, legal issues coming in. They do this. This is not their first time doing this. They've done this numerous times. If they have a problem with you, uh-huh, this is what they do. They will call your boss. They will call and make complaints, write emails, even call to harass you. Oh, they have been doing this for a long time. They infiltrate companies to cause problems. They infiltrate companies to cause problems. Something is going wrong this time around. They are caught up in something really bad. Their lives are falling apart. And this is karma. This is just the start for them. They'll get their old, their, their little friends, their insecure and immature little friends to start working with them. Everybody that they work with at other companies, they'll call them. And tell them to call so they can harass you, file false complaints on you to your boss, your supervisors, in an attempt, attempt to get you fired. This is what a couple is doing behind the scenes. For some of you, there's your ex, this is your ex doing this. But this is what a couple is doing behind the scenes trying to get someone fired. They have their little friends from previous companies, people in their lives, even family members. They have them calling to harass you. They're out here blackmailing people to participate in something they don't want to be a part of. This is how low down and insecure someone a couple is, especially the masculine. Low down, insecure. Instrument must not be the right size. It must be ski. It must be real ski ski. Look at that. These are people that fail to self actualize. Because the truth is out, they're having a hard time moving on. Exactly. People are seeing the truth about them that they're nothing but liars, disingenuine, unholy, not gifted. Okay? Not in touch with their inner child, like creativity. There's a woman out here that's been pretending to be you. Pretending to be a uh, star C. She's not that. The truth is exposed about her. Okay. 
People are walking away from working with these people now. People are walking away. There is absolutely a couple that does this regularly. That this man caused it making someone's life miserable. He said you offend him, he can make your life miserable. So he's out stalking you. Oh yeah, he's out stalking you. Interfering with your life and everything. And he did have legal issues coming in, just like I said. They've done this before. This is not their first time. They've done this before. This is their MO. This is how they destroy people's lives. Even if you work for work in a company with this person, they were doing the same thing. They'll have their little friends again from other companies that they worked with call and make false reports. Yeah, they'll call and make false reports. They say, oh, you were supposed to, oh, okay, let me use this as an example. I do like interviews and stuff, right? Uh, I do background checks and things. I do recruiting from home. They'll call, let's say you, me and these people, the husband, the wife, let's say one of us work in the same company. They'll have their friends from outside the company call my supervisor or the higher ups at maybe corporate and tell them, oh, you know, I was supposed to come for my interview. She didn't interview me. She didn't even call me back. Oh, you know, my, um, I still haven't gotten any calls back about my uh, background check results. Blah, 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 blah. This is what someone does behind the scenes. And he thinks that this is going to get you fired from work. He's done this to many people before, got them fired, got, them, got their careers destroyed. And he does not understand why it's not working anymore. Or it does not, it's not working on you. Someone has been trying to get someone fired from their work. There's a couple that has been trying to get someone fired from their work, but their boss is not doing it. And it's pissing them off. For some of you, your bosses are in cahoots with someone behind the scenes and they're waiting for the right time to strike. But whoever you are specifically that this message is coming up, coming up for your boss is refusing to fire you. Because whatever these people are doing, he can see right through it. He sees right through it. Oh, honey, he sees right through it. Someone is very gifted. They don't realize that. He sees right through them. They, they think that they have the upper hand, but this man actually has the upper hand or the woman has the upper hand, whoever your boss is. And they don't realize there's proof out here about what they've been doing. They have legal issues coming in, problems, I'm telling you. They have legal issues coming in. They've been doing this for years, and they're living in fear. You have legal issues coming in. They thought they got away with this. They thought they got away with it. They've been doing this to people for years. But you know, as I always say, source will let you do something to a hundred people, a thousand people, but there will be that one person you meet that you F up and do it to. And source will check you. Source will check you. There's a queen of wands being exposed out here as someone that's disingenuine. She's not gifted. Someone is not talented. She's been out here pretending to have skills that she doesn't have. Been copying someone. Been pretending to be someone she's not. Someone is leaving her out in the cold. And she's behind the scenes fighting with people. She don't understand why he's leaving. She don't understand why they are letting her go. She don't understand why he doesn't want to give her money. That man is leaving. Someone is a burden on, him, on her. On him. Excuse me. He sees her as a burden. Don't got nothing going on for herself. But she wants to hold on to someone. She wants to say we're in a relationship. What kind of relationship is that? When only one person, yeah, you, you, you're free to go. He says you're free to go. I swear when this car flew out, that's what I heard. Free to go. You are free to go. Collective, you yourself, you're free to go on your journey. Because these are the people that have been holding you back. Not realizing that the karma was right back, right, right in front of their doors. They said, oh. You want to stop the star seed from elevating in life? Okay, we'll put pause on your finances as well. So if she did something to interfere with your finances, source took care of it. He said, oh, you know how that man you got 
be spending money on you because you don't want to work. Mm -hmm. You know how you like to pretend like you are a impressed energy, even though you don't got none of those qualities. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, we're going to be taking that bag. You know, that man you see as a bag. That's how you secure your bag. We're taking your securing bag source away. Let's see what you're about to do. So you take money from someone, we take it from you too. Oh, and this empress here, we're going to expose the fact that you're not the true empress. This is actually the true empress. Oh, someone is burning behind the scenes. Someone is going to have to leave you alone. She's forced to, don't got no options. She got to leave you alone because she has legal issues coming in for fooling around with a queen of cups, trying to end a queen of cups, baby. She's going through a death and a tower was working with her lover behind the scenes. I'm telling you to come for a healer. Girl, you tried it. This is your future. This is what they wanted to do to a healer. This is your future. Balance has been brought in this situation. This healer is moving on. Focus on their pentacles. Receiving genuine commitments in life. They were paying people, honey, to have you trapped in something. But this cycle is over. You are not stuck. They are. Because someone is taking action to bring balance into this situation and it's terrifying her. Commitment. Moving on. Sailing on to calmer waters. Divine timing. Victory. Standing your ground. You're protected. I'm telling you. And you're going to have options. Listen. The burden this woman has coming in is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. No one should ever be this committed to destroying another person's future or life for a man. You want to tell me all the other fish in the sea, you don't see them? There's only one man, one masculine in the whole wide world? That's what you're telling me? And then she finds out the man still wants to leave after she's pulled all the stunts. It's like you're at a circus. This man's been watching a whole, a whole circus in his home, in his life. With what this woman has been doing, trying to prove that she's the empress, that she's gifted, she's divine. She's the best option. And after all of that, doing all those tricks, stand on your knees, stand on your knees. Doing all kinds of stuff. He's still leaving. So now she planned to take him out. You, 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 these are stuff you only see in the movies. These are things you see in the movies. This man said, I'm cutting my loss. You, you guys to go. I can't do this with you. I want to grow. I want to bring balance in my life. And I see that with that queen of cups. So this situation here is dead. It's a tower for you and I, I know, but we'll be okay. I'll uh, rebuild myself somewhere else with this healer and I'm going to heal. I'm telling you. She's trapped in her mind. <laughs> having, having heart problems. Mental problems, all kinds of problems. These are the kind of people that do voodoo behind the scenes, be sending you death spells, heart spells, all kinds of spells. You will not wake up tomorrow, but the collective keeps waking up every day. It's like, I need you to stop waking up. Just go away. Go away. Everything was fine until you came along. I was able to pretend to be an empress and get away with it. Not anymore. That brother needed to go through an awakening. That's why the high priestess came about. Because if that high priestess did not come about, you would still be out here doing that circus show. And he would still be sitting there talking about, ooh, Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. All excited. Not knowing the whole time you were making a fool out of him. So these high priestesses bringing light to the truth is justice for some of these masculines because they just don't know. They don't know how how bad, how deep they are asleep. They don't know. And they'll never know until high priestesses come around, star seeds come around, so that they can help them free themselves. Free themselves. Okay? This is, that's his justice for the truth to be revealed about you. For the truth to be revealed about you, what you really are. You don't want to be called and seen as what you are. You ain't nothing but a tramp. A gold digging tramp. Answers unfolding. I told you all. Answers unfold. 
Keep your mind open and be willing to learn from this experience. Make changes. Miss Jizzy Bell, you hear that? Mr. King of Swords. Being too busy. Make time to rest, relax, and nurture yourself. Give yourself a break. Okay? Please do that. Don't neglect yourself. Do not neglect yourself. Okay? Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Stay blessed. I'll see you in my next free. Goodbye for now.